So are we, are we ready to have some fun this afternoon and open up some things that you didn't have to pay for? <laughs> That's always my favorite part of anything, getting something I didn't pay for. I think it's everybody's favorite part of anything. <laughs> All right, guys, so here is how this is going to work. Um, first, let's take a look at who is in this break. And this, of course, is our customer appreciation break. So uh, the only way to get into this break, of course, was to be the winner of the nightly random. And if I could get my mouse to work here, we might be doing all right. Let's try this again, see if we can scroll. <laughs> what is happening? There we go, whoa. Yeah, mobile uh, mobile mouse, life's, life's fun, good times. So if you see your name on this list, of course that means you're in this break. Now here's what we're going to do. We've got a, a, a handful of products on the table and any one of those products could be open today. We're not going to open every single one of them, but what we are going to do is uh, let random.org decide which of those things that we're going to open. So we'll open two of the products that are possible on, on our table. So what we have as possibilities, let's get these where you can see them a little better. What we have for possibilities is this box of threads here from 20, I think 13, 14, and it's got, I think, four hits in it. We have this possibility of Crown Royal Football. It's got four hits in it. Possibility of Topps Prime Football, and it has also four hits in it, I think. Possibility of Topps Archives Signature Series from 2015. It has one hit in it. And then a possibility of Archive 65th Anniversary Edition, and it has one guaranteed autograph hit in it. I'm not sure if there's more than one in it, but there's definitely one in it. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to number these. Hi, Jimmy. How are you, man? You doing okay today? Hopefully. Let's just number them in the way that we talked about them. So, we'll call Threads 1, Crown Royal 2, Prime is 3, Archives is 4, and that is 5. So, we're going to put these five, start out by putting these five boxes into random, and random's going to tell us which of those things we're going to open. But it's not going to be just as simple as that because I'm going to give you some options if you're watching live. So if you are watching live, then what I'm going to say to you is log in right now so that you're able to chat because it may be to your benefit here in a minute. All right, so number three and number two are what have come up here. Number three and number two are what we're going to open up. So number three was what? Number three is Topps Prime Football. Number two is Crown Royal football. All right, so we didn't get any basketball and any baseball out of that. But that's okay, because I'm going to give you some options. Because let's say you're in the break. Before we, now that we know which products that we're going to open, but before we actually start pulling the hits, I'm going to give you something to think about here. We know that there are going to be eight hits, and I'm going to, or at least it appears to be, that says one autograph relic one aut and one autograph card and then two relic cards per box. So yeah, so that looks like four. This we know is four. So in a second, we're gonna put everybody in random and we're gonna have the top eight people. Before we actually start opening this product, I'm gonna give those eight people the chance to trade away their hit in that box if they want to. And if you want to, then you're gonna have a mystery, a mystery swap is what I call it. And there are 10 different things that you could pull out of that mystery swap. But it does mean that you'll give up your hit before you even know what your hit is. All you know right now is what the products are. But let's say you only like, uh, you know, you don't, you don't care about either one of those products. So you'd rather maybe swap out and give a shot at something else. You're going to have that chance if you're one of these top eight. And if that's the case, if you do swap out, then we'll move on down the line and let somebody else have your hit and so on and so forth. So here's everybody that's in there. Let's get that far. And hi, Shauna and Jack and Patrick and Jesse and Disney Nerd, <laughs> who is Abby Med 51. Hi, guys. All right, so Random's got it out for us. So SNR Surplus 1, Stang Lover, which cracks me up because he always says that Random is terrible to him, but it's not. <laughs> 
2-19 uh, at key Chris, uh, at key, well, it doesn't say Chris, but I know it's Chris, so I kind of mentally filled in the blanks, sorry. <laughs> Jay LaBreeze, Tenacious P, Spider Soccer 14, and Abby Med 51. Okay, guys, so of the eight of you, these top eight, we know that Abby Med is online right now. We see that Jack is online. Um, a couple of you, I don't remember what name goes with, uh, well, there's only two really where I don't remember. So if you're in there, one of these others, let me know if you want to do any swapping out or if you want to keep your hits so that they're going to come out of the box. And if you swap, basically you have a chance at getting something better. You have a chance at getting something the same, or you could get something that's not as good because I mean, you know, some of that stuff's going to be unopened too. Oh, Patrick, you're Tenacious P. Awesome. Thank you. Sometimes I have a hard time remembering whose actual name goes with their username. All right. So does anybody want to swap before we start opening these boxes? This is uh, SNR Surplus, Stang Lover, Tudash, uh, Atkins, Jack, Tenacious P, which is Patrick, Spider Soccer, and Abby Med. Everybody keeping or anybody switching? Oh, okay, so you want me to explain it again? Okay, let me tell you, Let me, because sometimes I don't make good sense. I know that. <laughs> Basically, it's like this. There's going to be eight hits that are going to come out of these two boxes, at least according to what's on the box. You know, sometimes Panini will screw us over and give us a rewards point or something. So we're either going to, we're going to open these eight things. We're going to open these boxes up, okay? And if you keep your spot, Abby Med, then you are going to get the eighth hit, hit number eight, that comes out of one of these two boxes, whatever that eighth hit is. If for whatever reason, let's say you don't like football or you don't like these products or whatever, you're not interested in these hits and you want to take a chance on something else, then what you do is say, hey, I want to swap out. Then we would go into this little stack of cards right here. There are 10 things and there's something written on each side of, on the other, whoops, you can't see the camera, can you? <laughs> There's something written on the other side of these little 10 cards. And if you say, hey, I want to swap out, then we would put 1 through 10 in random. And let's say it came up with number 5. I would count down to number 5. We would flip it over. And that would be your hit instead. In other words, you would give up hit number 8 out of one of these two boxes in exchange for a hit out of our little swap pile. Did that make more sense? And opening, we are doing Tops Prime and Crown Royal. And Shauna, we are not doing teams on this. Uh, what we're doing is the top eight people who came up in random have a chance right now to either keep their hits out of these two boxes or they have a chance to swap out and take something out of the swap pile. And once we know what they're going to do, then we'll go from there. All right, so Abby Med, you want to keep your spot well, no, Jack, I'm not going to tell you what are in the swap pile. That takes all the fun out of it. Like I said, some things are maybe have more value. Some things might have less value. Some things might have equal value. And really, we don't know, period, because we don't know what's going to come out of there. So it's truly, totally a gamble. All right, so Patrick, you're staying put. Not necessarily, Shauna, not necessarily everyone else is out. Hang around. That doesn't necessarily mean that everybody else is out. All right, so Abby Med is staying put. Tenacious P is staying put. Um, Patrick, what do you want to You said you do. Jack, what do you want to do? You're going to swap. Okay, Jack is going for the swap. All right, so let's do two things here then. First of all, we're going to grab, uh, we're going to grab everybody from this list, one through eight, and we're going to take them and move them around a little bit because I want to remember what order everyone is in. And it's going to print them tiny. See, I knew it would. It always prints them so tiny right there. I don't know why when you do that cut and paste. So we're just going to make them big so we can see it. All right, so Jack is going to swap. So we're going to go ahead and take care of that. And that means... Since Jack is going to swap, which we'll swap you out here in a minute, Jack, so not to worry. Don't go wandering off on me. We need to try to make all this so that I can actually see it. 
So then that's going to put us back over here. Why can't you guys see what I see? What happened? Now you can see it. So that means that Tim ought sim is now in on the regular break because we had somebody swap out. Jack swapped out. He doesn't want one of the hits out of there. So that means that we are putting... Why does this keep going away? We are putting Tim ought sim in and he will have a chance at one of the hits out of the box. And I know this takes a little bit longer. I get that, guys. But I'm just trying to make it fun for everybody. And some people might not like the products that we're opening and things like that. And also, Shauna, this still doesn't mean to go away because there's still other possibilities. Oh, Jesse, you want to swap out too? Okay, then let's put you in here. You're going to swap out. Why does it, oh, why does everything print in such the tiny thing? I keep trying to change it. <laughs> so that means we're going to go back into random. And we're going to take uh, Casey's dad is now going to move in as well into our hits list out of our two boxes. All right, so here goes Casey's dad is now in. Anybody else? Anybody else want to swap or do anything else? No? We're good? Whoops. Everybody is set and happy and ready with the way we have it right now? Okay. And we're still not totally done, Shauna, so hang around. And anybody else that isn't in yet, you still may have another shot. So, here's we've got this little stack right here of 10 swap possibilities. And you don't know what you're going to pull out of there, but we're about to find out. And I will let you take a look at everything that's in there when we get to the end of the break. So first up, Jack, since you said first that you wanted to swap, then we will, we will roll over here and take care of your swap first. Let's see what you're going to pull out of the pile. All right, so Jack, this is yours coming out right now. Whatever number comes out, we're going to count down in this pile, and you're right dead in the middle, number five. So let's count. So this would be, that's actually the bottom. So there's one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, your swap is a 2015 Prism Football Blaster Box. That is your swap. So let's go ahead and get your blaster box opened and we'll see what you get in this. And this has a hit in it. I don't know what the hit is, but it does say it has a hit in it. So, and of course, you know, you can always hit other stuff. Let's put these back a minute. So this that I'm opening right now, this is all just going to Jack because he swapped out of his potential hits from uh, Prime and Crown. And this is what he hit. Now normally I would only ship the hits out of something, but Jack, because you swapped and got this, if you want all these cards, let me know. I will send them all. If you only want like the refractors and the hits and the, I'm sorry guys, hang on. If you only want uh, the refractors and the hits and stuff like that instead the rookie cards whatever then just let me know and we'll ship just what you want out of it if you want them all we'll ship them all since uh since you did a swap for this there's an insert air marshal for flacco kid reporter little ad card it's a nice little tom brady insert fireworks andrew white rookie refractor Another ad card. Mike Davis Premier Jerseys hit. Uh, refractor Materials hit. Another ad card. Good grief. How many ad cards do we need in one pack of things? Hey, there's another Tom Brady uh, die cut insert. So you got a couple of uh, Brady die cuts in there. Can't go too wrong with that. And another insert. Guess there's one per pack. That was going to be my assumption. Oh, nice little Randall Cobb red uh, parallel refractor. Artemis Payne was a rookie. 
All right, so Jack, just send me a message and let me know what um, you want out of that, okay? If you want all those cards, part of those cards, you know, just the inserts, just the rookies, just the hits, whatever, you let me know. Now, next up, of course, where our next swap is um, 2-19, which is Jesse. So, Jesse, we're going to go through the same thing with you, except instead of having 10 now, we only have 9 spots left in our little pile. So, we're going to be typing into 9 for you. And then as soon as we finish the swaps, we're going to get into opening our other products. Actually, we might do one. Well, yeah, we'll open our other products first, and then there'll be one little thing I'll have left at the end that we will do. And make sure that you are seeing the same thing I am seeing, which you are good. And that gives you number four out of our stack. Number four. So where did I set our stack? Here it is. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four. All right, your mystery swap is 2017 Leaf Draft Football 1 of 1. Okay, Jesse. So this is what you're coming home with. Is a 2017 Leaf Draft Football 1 of 1 autograph printing pack plate parallel. I just bought this this week. This is my first one of these that I have opened. So this is who you have. And it is, who is that? Derek Barnett. So Derek Barnett is your one of one autographed uh, printing plate. And Jesse, that is your hit since you swapped out and that's what you got. All right. All right. So now that's going to move us on down the line. And by the way, guys, this stuff will ship when your next order ships. And if you don't have a next order that comes up in like the next, uh, say, 10 days or so, then I'll ship whatever it is on its own. Just FYI. All right. So that's going to bring us back to our main list. And we have already swapped this out. So let's go ahead and highlight that. And that's out. And we'll highlight that. So that means here's how it's going to look. Our first hit that comes out will be for SNR Surplus 1. Our second hit will be Stang Lover. Our third will be At Key Chris. Our fourth, Tenacious P, followed by Spider Soccer, followed by Abby Med, followed by Timot Sim, followed by Casey's Dad. Okay? Now, because we don't know what order the hits are going to come out of, we also don't know which box they're going to, you know, which box is going to have what, we will again let random decide which box we open first and that's just in an effort to make sure that everything is completely random that there's no no uh, question that that we've done it the correct way in terms of giving everybody an equal chance so we're going to hit this three times since there's only two things in the list and then whatever it ends up with on the third time that's what we will open first All right, there it says three times. There's our date and time stamp, and Tops Prime will be opened first. So again, our first four hits are going to come out of this first box for Tops Prime, which is SNR Surplus One, Stang Lover Fifty Nine, Atkey Chris, and Tenacious P. Your hits should all be coming out of Tops Prime, which is what we're going to open up right now. And they will be in that order. So whichever one, whichever one we hit first, you know, we'll go to the first person that was on that list. Whichever hit comes out second, the second, and so on and so forth until all four hits are gone from here. Then we'll look at the list again and get into Crown Royal and do the same thing. And then everybody else who's left who hasn't been in one of these so far we'll do one more random out of our little random stack there and you will get a chance still to hit uh, something now on this that we're opening right now i'm only shipping hits out of this i'm not shipping uh base and all that out of tops prime we're only shipping the hits because really the hits are what we're interested in anyway that's marcus wheaton you know, I always like to see my Steelers. I always like to see my Steelers. 
So this is our first hit out, and there's uh, Jarvis Jones. Our first hit out is Marcus Lattimore to 165. Marcus Lattimore materials to 165. And that goes, let me look again, I don't even remember now. That goes to SNR Surplus 1. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in a sleeve and um, let's go ahead and put this in a sleeve and take care of that now so that I don't have to later go back and watch this video to figure out who has what. <laughs> let's just go ahead and do it now. All right, this is SNR Surplus 1. Now, guys, while I'm working on opening this stuff what do you prefer do you like do you like doing these monthly drawings not really drawings but breaks do you like the monthly break better or do you prefer a nightly random where either a card or you know materials card or an autograph card or whatever the case may be goes out every night do you have a preference as to which you like the best because obviously this is july 1st so we're going to be starting something new for july our second hit is Jordan Reed for the Redskins. And that, of course, is a materials hit and a signature. And I think if I'm remembering right that that's going to go to Stang Lover. But we are going to flip back to our spreadsheet and make sure that I am remembering that correctly. Yeah, that is Stang Lover 59. This is your hit. All right. There, so there is hit number two. Everybody likes the monthly better? All right, good. Then we will we will roll forward and do the same thing in July then that we have done in June. Mike Gillisley for the Dolphins is the next hit. It looks, yeah, that is four pieces of material. I wasn't sure if that was part of the card or if it was a piece of material, but it is a piece of material, so that is four pieces of material. I think I have the camera set a little, the focus set a little weird today, and I was holding that too close. I apologize. Trying to keep the background in a little more focus than I normally have it. I generally keep it so that it focuses just on the cards, but somebody complained about that recently, so I tried to adjust it a little. All right, so at key Chris gets this one. All right. So there is that one. We should have one hit left to find in here. Well, we're going to, um, I tell you what, Disney nerd, if you just hang tight, we still have a little bit, we still have a little bit to do. So you may still have a chance to, to ask for, you may still have a chance to, to get some stuff, but we, let me get through all the stuff we're doing with what we're opening first. And then I will get back to you on that. Because right now it is set up uh, that I only ship the hits out of all of this. What is that? T.Y. Hilton. So our last hit's got to be, there it is, it's going to be Frank Gore. There's our other base. All right, so our last hit is Frank Gore for the Niners with the sticker auto. And that was to, I've almost forgotten now, Tenacious P. So, Patrick, that's yours. Right here. I like your username, by the way. I think that's, uh, that's pretty fun. <laughs> So that means Crown Royal is what we're going to open up next. And as we open up Crown Royal, that is going to put us to um, Spider Soccer. We'll take the first hit from Crown Royal. Abby Med will get the second. Tim Ott Sim, the third. And Casey's Dad, the fourth. And of course, because you know I won't remember that, we'll, we'll look at it after we open each hit anyway. <laughs> As you know, I will have forgotten by the time we get the hits open, right? I mean, because that's, uh, 
yeah, that's just how it goes with me, it seems like. Hit number one is Robert Woods. We'll go ahead and we can look at the rest of those. Robert Woods, Heirs to the Throne to 299 is hit number one. So let's flip back over here. I think that was, was that, uh, yeah, Spider Soccer. Spider Soccer 14. This is your hit. Soccer 14. All right. Pack number two is, that's a dummy blank card. Ray Graham to 99. He's in a Texans uniform, but you see it says Steelers on there. And of course, has a Steelers logo there on the back as well because he was uh, traded. So that one is headed off to Abby Med. That's yours. Abby Med 51, also known as Disney Nerd, which I like. I like Disney too, have to say. I enjoy going to Disney. Always have. And I just wrote Disney Nerd on here <laughs> as I was saying it. Ah, oh, I told you. My mind, my mind. We'll fix it. Now it says Abby. Now it says Abby Med <laughs> and Disney Nerd because I wrote. Disney nerd. That's what I was saying. <laughs> so awful. So awful when your mind goes, isn't it? Maybe I never had it to begin with. But that's uh, another story for a different day. Tyler Wilson for the Raiders. Oh, nice patch. Uh, nice patch. I really like that. And on card auto numbered to 49 on the Tyler Wilson. And it. Heads off to Tim Ott Sim. Tim Ott Sim. Let's get that one marked. We've got one hit left to go, and then we're going to do one more little thing for those of you who did not uh, make it into this main break. And I remember this one. This one's Casey's dad, because this is the last one. <laughs> so I was able to retain that one. Casey's dad. And it is Andrew Luck. Andrew Luck materials hit to 299 Knights of the Gridiron. Going to Casey's dad. Which, you know, because I put the spreadsheet up for all the others, even though I remember that one, we'll put it up anyway. So there it is. Casey dad, this is yours. Okay, now, here comes the next part. If you are online, which I know at least a couple of you are, uh, Jenny and Shauna, a couple of you that, that weren't in that break are online. So I'm going to ask you what you would like to do now. We can either put everybody in, and there'll be one winner that will come out of that little stack of swap things. We'll pick one one card out of there and one winner out of everybody else who wasn't in the break thus far. Or you can have one winner can have all of the um, refractors, rookie cards, and numbered inserts out of the stack. And if you guys don't have a preference that are online right now, then I will put it in uh, random and let random decide which thing we do. So those are the options. All the rookie cards and refractors and numbered inserts out of here or something out of the swap pile, which could be better than that, could be worse than that. So, <laughs> All right, so Jimmy, are you voting for... So when you say hit, are you? do you mean the stack of cards or do you mean out of the swap pile? Oh, hi, Mike. Swap pile is what Shauna meant. Okay, is that what you mean to um, Jimmy and Mike? I'm assuming it is. If that's, yeah, that's what you guys all mean. All right, cool. So we went as far down. Let's go back into our spreadsheet here. So we went as far down as, um, did I not copy over the full list? Ah, oh, bollocks. I meant to, and I guess I didn't. 
I thought I copied over the whole list of things from random. I only copied over the first 10. Well, fiddle. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. We're going to put everybody in, but i got to take out the 10 of you who have, uh, who have already participated and already have something. You 10 are not going to be in uh, this, so we'll have to... We'll cut and paste, and then we'll get you out of there so that everybody else has a has a chance to win. Because you guys already won. So let's uh, find everybody in here. Casey's dad, that's gone. I really thought I copied that whole thing. How stupid of me. Those are gone. Dang lover, tenacious P. Some days I just uh, get ahead of myself, I guess. Spider soccer was one. Jesse, got you already. And surplus. Was that was that everybody? I think that's everybody, right? I think it is. If I miss somebody and you've already won and you come up again in this random now, then, you know, we'll just take the next one down. But So one winner, whoever comes up on top, then you're going to have one shot to pull something out of the swap pile, of which there are eight things left. And it is Richard Dunn 3. Richard Dunn 3. So, Richard, are you on? you online right now? You watching live? If you are, I'll just maybe let you pick the number that you want. Uh, why does that keep doing that? Ah, why does it keep giving me a blank screen? I don't know what is going on with this today. Every time I update that flipping software, it then goes crazy on me for a period of time. I don't know what the deal is. All right, so I'm going to assume that Richard Dunn 3 is not online because he hasn't come forth and said anything, so we're going to assume not. So we'll once again let random choose something, and it chooses number two out of our swap pile. Let me get us switched back over here. And this number two out of our swap pile is going to Richard Dunn 3. Richard Dunn 3's mystery swap. Free shipping for the month of July will ship one time a week. So bid away, Richard Dunn 3. Um, but here's the thing. Don't ever pay your invoice <laughs> until I have manually adjusted it to zero. Okay? Because you know eBay sends out stuff, right? And they send, and I can't control that. They send out those automated invoices. There's nothing I can do about that. Not one flipping thing. And you don't want to pay from that because it will have a shipping charge on there. So you want to wait for me every time, anytime you buy anything all month, Richard Dunn 3, wait for a manual invoice that shows $0 shipping before you pay it, okay? And then I will ship to you one time a week, no charge to you for all breaks for the month of July. So let's, uh, i tell you what, we're going to review what everybody has here, but before... We review what everybody has. We'll look at what else was in our mystery swap pile because I know you guys want to know. We had a $5 credit on a future July break. We had 2014 Prism Draft Picks Baseball Hobby Pack, a 2013 Tops Mini Hobby Pack, 2012-13 Hoops Hobby Pack, a Cornelius Randolph Autograph Card from 2015 Bowman's Best, a 2016 Contenders Basketball Blaster Box, and a 2015 Prism Rookie Jersey Card for Jamius Winston. So those were the options, the other options in the swap pile. So let's go through our hits. Um, of course, our first swap out was Jack. So Jack had hit the Prism Blaster Box. So this stuff here all went uh, via the swap to Jack. And then Jesse swapped out, and he ended up getting 2017 Leaf Draft Football 1 of 1 autographed printing plate. So that was his swap. And then everybody else, uh, of course, oh, we, had, we did have, uh, who won that? Now I've already forgotten. who. Oh, this is one we just did, Richard Dunn, Richard Dunn 3. Let's write that on there right now. <laughs> That's the one we did for everybody that didn't make it into the main break 
This is Richard Dunn 3 with the free shipping for the month of July. Then our other hits, SNR Surplus, uh, got the materials hit out of Topps Prime. Stang Lover material autograph hit out of Topps Prime. At Key Chris with the uh, materials hit. Again, still in Topps Prime. Tenacious P with autograph hit. Spider Soccer with the materials hit, piece of ball, and piece of uh, jersey. And Abby Med, which I also wrote Disney Nerd on there because I'm an idiot, um, with the autograph hit of Ray Graham. Tim Ott Sims with the on-card auto and materials hit for Tyler Wilson. And then we wrapped it up with Casey's dad who got uh, the Andrew Luck material. So guys, that's it for the customer appreciation break for the month of July. I appreciate everybody breaking with me as always. And remember this stuff will ship out with your next package. Or if you don't have another package coming in the next 12 to 14 days, then I'll ship it on its own, you know, at that point. So, of course, we've got a lot of things ending tonight. So if you feel the urge, jump in and bid and we'll be breaking some more stuff in a few hours. Thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate your business very much, and we'll see you soon.